Hey YouTube, it's Carla from Stanton Shenanigans and I'm back with you guys today with another video. And like I told y'all, I had been wanting to try breakfast videos, um, uh, especially like the eggs and stuff. So I finally got my birthday card that was mailed on the 24th of January. I got it like I think Wednesday of last week. Anyway, uh, and I had gotten an uh, Amazon gift card, so I bought two meal cold weathers and I got them uh, from Ozark Outfitters, I think. I, uh, don't quote me on that. But it was, they were literally here in two days. And they weren't supposed to be here till today, so I got them Friday, I believe. And I ordered them Wednesday, so yeah, I'm very impressed with the way they uh, send out stuff. And it was free shipping. It was FedEx. So, anyway, this is a Sapaco meal at a Mullins, South Carolina. It's a menu: ten scrambled eggs with cheese, Western style. And these are super fresh, you guys. This was packed on the 348th day of 2022. So this is so super fresh. So let's crack it open. I'm gonna move this out of the way for a minute. If you got, I'm sorry, my hands are swelled up this morning. On the weekends, I door dash, and driving makes my hands swell up a little bit. So. Anyway, let's crack this bad boy open if I can. I may have to use the damn scissors. Who knows? Oh, come on. Get out of there. I've almost got it, y'all. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. I might have to crack out one of my knives up here or something. I don't know. They make them, they make them to where you can peel them sometimes really easy. And other times, not so much. <laughs> But it's okay. We'll get it. It just gives me a longer amount of time to uh, talk to y'all. I've already got my water heated up from my kettle. So that's a start. <laughs> Come on now. I, I can see. I can see almost. Like, look, y'all. I've almost got just this little old tiny bit. I just need to get my fingernail in there, I think. But then they break. <laughs> I know you're not going to open, are you? All right, let's get a pair of scissors. I need them anyway. So. Uh, yeah. It pulled, but I can't. Yeah, it didn't. So, yeah, we're just going to. Hello, Christian. Okay, we'll just cut this bad boy right open just like that. Let's not make this any harder than it has to be. Now we got it open, and as you can see, there's no inner bag, so it's all kind of loose in there. Go ahead and get this out of the way. Put this back up here, so you guys can see. I can't. It's hard for me to see because I'm looking kind of upside down. So I do a pop. Actually, I go like that. No, it goes like that. Okay. Well, we'll just have a confusing video today. How about that? Okay, here we go. I pull everything out of here. And then, um, of course, the bag is empty. I've got everything out along the side, so I'm just going to use it as a uh, garbage bag. The first thing we have is some granola with milk and blueberries. Oh, I can't wait to try this. I love blueberries. Don't let my daughter know about that. She might want it. We have an orange beverage base, so it'd be like having orange juice with breakfast, and I do happen to have a drink cup here and everything, so we'll just put that right there. We also have a toaster pastry frosted, a frosted one, this one they're not, they're going all out with frosting on it. Uh, brown sugar and cinnamon toaster pastry. I don't like these, so I'll let Rich have that one because I'm not crazy about brown sugar and cinnamon ones. I like blueberry ones or chocolate. We have a maple muffin top. Oh, that looks good. Very yummy. We have our accessory pack, and I'll just set that right there for right now. And we have our handy dandy military spoon. Best spoon ever made next to the Canadian and Australian. I really like their spoons too. Canadian spork and the Australian spoon. Let's see what this is. Ooh, cheddar cheese pretzels. I bet they're kind of like, they feel like combos, like the combos, which I really like. And then we have a chocolate hazelnut cocoa beverage powder. I'm gonna go ahead and let Rich have that because um, I already have a coffee made that I that I am drinking out of my Mike Kreischer cup. I don't know if y'all can see that really good. <laughs> He sent me a lovely cup, and I use it just almost daily. 
So anyway, I'll save this for Richard. And then we have our main here, which is a mountain house, Western style scrambled eggs, ham, peppers, and cheese. And it doesn't look like a lot, but once we open it and all that, you'll see. So um, let's go ahead and get this started. Let me get a clip put on it. And then we'll open up our accessory pack after that. Uh, this was packed on the 310th day of 2023. Um, it's really compacted in here. You can't even really see the ingredients. Let me see if it shows on here, the nutritional. Oh, here it is. Well, let's get it open because I can't see it. It's, it's pretty, uh, and all I'm going to do is just cut right here on the, underneath the opening. You can kind of hear it trying to open. It was trying to hiss a little bit, but let's go ahead and get it open. Let's see if we can. And it has in here pre-cooked scrambled eggs, whole eggs, uh, the glucose is removed for stability, egg yolk, non-fat dairy milk, modified corn starch, corn oil, salt, yeast extract, which is, yeast extract, you guys, is literally Vegemite, just so you know that. Uh, let's see, ham, salt, uh, cured flavor, cheddar cheese, just all kinds of stuff. It's all freeze-dried, and um, this is what it looks like, if you guys can see it. Can't really smell anything, but let's go ahead and get some water in here, and it says to add in two stages. Uh, eight ounces of hot water. I'm going to put a little in here and I just go with a little at a time because you can always add more. You just can't take it away. And it always seems like these always ask for more than they really need. So let's try that. I got boiling. Ooh, I smell it now. The minute that water hits it, it brings out all the good smells. It's like a western omelet basically, but it's scrambled eggs rather than the regular. Oh, it smells really smoky with that bacon. Yeah, goodness gracious, that smells really good. So I'm getting it really, trying to get it really stirred up in here. Get that down in that water. So, it, okay. And what I'm going to do is just go ahead and I'll flip it and set it over here to the side. Right there. And I'll set my timer for, we'll set it for five minutes and then see how it does after that. And then if I have to add more, I'll add more. Okay, let's open our accessory kit. And it says it's a meal cold weather accessory kit packed on the 326th day of 2022. So let's go ahead and crack this open. It looks like your basic stuff that you get in all of them. Um, let's see, let me get this out of the way for a second. Well, <laughs> today is not my day for opening things. We have a moist towelette. We have your matches, white tip for damp climate. We have a creamer non-dairy. We have a Bill's Brew. Some gum and I love these little Tabasco things they are so amazing they're really really cool little Tabasco sauce we have a little sugar for what I don't know maybe you need it in your cereal and we have some butt paper so that is all that's in the accessory pack it doesn't say if it's an A or B it just says it's meal cold weather it's all it says and so that is our accessories and we'll just go ahead and set this over to the side um the only thing i might need is just the paper and we'll set that over here <clears throat> and then we'll go ahead and get our beverage base mix done and this is orange beverage base it is sugar free and it just needs a 20 ounces of water i got a cup uh, a 20 ounces of, uh, or 16 of, uh, bottled water. So let's just 
Yeah, I, I'm not having good luck with opening stuff today, apparently. Good night. All right. Let's get this bad boy in here. There we go. I like orange juice, especially with breakfast. It doesn't care for me too much, but I do like orange juice. Sometimes it can be a little too sweet. So I'm glad this is sugar-free. And it'll probably taste like either Tang, if you all remember Tang. Some of you guys might be a little too young to remember Tang. But um, I'm going to get this. Uh-oh. Earthquake on my, with my drink here. <laughs> I forgot to wipe my spoon off from, from stirring the main up. I hope you guys are doing well today. Uh, it was nice here this weekend. Really good door dashing days. I mean, it is what it is, but it's, it, you know. All right, let's go ahead and get this mixed up. Okay, let's go ahead and smell. Ooh, it smells like tang. Kind of smells like Sunny D also. Oh yeah, that's good. That's really good. Very, very, very good. Okay. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and set this to the side so that Rich can have that when he gets home. He's at work right now, so let's go ahead and makeup, I'm gonna get a little bowl for this. <clears throat> Let's see here. Allow water. Allow water just mm -hmm. chemically purified to stand 30 minutes before. Okay, well, my water's fine. Open pouch, remove oxygen scavenger. Okay, two to three ounces of water for the pouch, stir and consume within one hour. Okay, well I'm gonna put hot water in it because I like hot cereal. So, let's just go for it. Why not? Let's see what's in here. Let's see if I can smell it. There's the oxygen absorber. We don't want that. You can actually keep those though and reuse them if you like. That's what's inside there. We'll go ahead and pour it out here. As you can see, it's got the milk and everything already in it. All you do is just add a little bit of water, and it means just a little bit. You don't need a whole lot. I think that'll probably do it. I'm not a big cereal person because I don't like milk, but now this kind of stuff doesn't really bother. Look how pretty that color is on there. Y'all, this is like, I love blueberries. It's my favorite, favorite fruit. Actually, strawberries are, but unfortunately, I'm allergic. So, blueberries it is. Let me let this go ahead and try to reconcentrate just a little bit on those blueberries. While that's doing that, we'll go ahead and get our other stuff out. Now, Christian, you know that you can't have these things. He's always in the kitchen wanting something. At least he knows where to go. Okay, let's go ahead and check our main. And then I'll probably have to add a little more water to it. But let's see. That was my timer. Yeah, it looks like it could probably just be stirred up a little more. I don't think it needs any more water at all. And it's just right. So we'll go ahead and let that sit a little longer it still looks like it needs to absorb a little more so just it smells so good it literally smells like a fresh Denver omelet that's been made or a Western omelet however you you all prepare your omelets so let's go ahead and let the cereal sit for a minute and then we'll uh, do our cheddar cheese pretzels let's go ahead and get those open Kind of a weird combination for breakfast, but okay. And let's see, there's a tear notch right here. Yep, tear notches in my hands. And my hands are hurting me today because of them being swollen. So I do apologize. I have rheumatoid arthritis in my hands quite 
quite a lot. So one day, once in a while, they bug me. But today, it's just from driving. But that's what they are. Look, guys, it's combos. Yay, I love them, especially the pretzel and cheese ones. So no oxygen absorber. And I forgot to look at when they were packed in that. I do apologize, y'all. I'm just I'm just waking up this morning. So <laughs> this is her maple muffin top. Let's go ahead and get that open. There is an oxygen absorber on this one. Looks like a little oh goodness, it smells good. You don't want that. There you should is. That looks really good. It smells fantastic. It smells like a pancake. Let me go ahead and I'm going to set another timer for my, uh, we'll go ahead and eat a bite of the cereal. Let's see here. That's what it looks like, you guys. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Having, having the blueberries crunchy is really not bad. It's very sweet, but not super duper sweet. The blueberries are just, I don't know, blueberries. The cereal is really, really good. That's really good. I like it. Mm -hmm. That's really fabulous. Well, mm-hmm. But, I'll have to finish that off camera because if I eat too much of that, I won't be able to eat the main. <laughs> so, let's try this maple muffin top. Oh, it's really good. It's very moist, very dense. Doesn't that look really good, y'all? Mm -hmm. I'm going to clean my palate. I still got cereal in my mouth. <laughs> I want to taste this right. Not with just blueberry in my mouth. So, hmm. Taking me a minute. It's stuck in my teeth. I'll have some more orange beverage base. Oh, yeah, that's good. I really like that orange. That's really good. All right, let's try a bite. That's what it looks like. As you can see, it's very moist, very dense. It smells good. Mm-hmm. It's really good. Oh, man, that's good. Mm-hmm. And it's not really sweet. It's not as sweet as you would think it is. But it's really good. I'm not going to eat those yet because I don't feel it's a morning food. So I'll probably just put them in a baggie and eat them as a snack later. But I just wanted you guys to see what they look like. So I'm going to have a drink out of my coffee that I made already. I like Cafe Bustelo. I like my coffee light and sweet. I put uh, stevia in it and half and half. All right, so I thought I already had a little Tabasco open over here. I thought I did from one of my other videos. I do apologize. Ooh. I also have some cheese spread that I think I might put in these eggs. They're supposed to have cheese in them, but I may add it. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. I gotta have another bite of this cereal though because it's really, really good. I love blueberries in this. I would say out of all the mueslis and cereals that I've had, this would be my favorite. This one here, even though um, it's kind of basic, but you know, Tastes good to me. So let's see how many minutes we got left. Got two minutes, y'all. So anyway, I hope you guys are doing really good. And if you're here for the first time visiting, welcome. Thank you for uh, visiting our channel. And I hope you enjoy what you see. Sometimes we don't always do uh, military rations because um, we like to do other shenanigans, shenanigans, if you will. <laughs> we love to go to the racetrack. They're not open right now because it's winter time, but. They will be soon. The spring spring hot rod reunion will be up soon. And then, let's see. The Mopar days. I like those because I like Mopars. 
Mopar would be like your Dodge Charger, Challengers, stuff like that. Um, and we like to go hang out with our friends and play Cards Against Humanity. Sometimes uh, we could we'll have to go live doing that once in a while, but we can get a little a little rowdy, so we have to be, kind of be careful. Although, you know, it is what it is. If you guys are here again visiting us, welcome back. We appreciate you guys coming and visiting us. It's always a pleasure to have you here. And if you don't mind, hit that like button. Hit that like button. That really gets us out in the algorithm and helps our channel to be noticed by other people. And also, let's see. And if you want to subscribe, you could subscribe. We just had a giveaway for 200 subs. Or it was 250 subs, excuse me. Maybe it was 250. I can't remember. But anyway, um, and every day that I, you know, our channel is growing and growing. And I'm so thankful for, for every one of you. Thank you so much. And, and hit me up with comments and, and ask me questions. Um, I am going to drop a cash app in my um, description if you guys would like to donate to the channel to help me buy more um, rations and stuff. Um, it's not a, uh, you don't have to, if you'd like, if, you know, it's just a way to support the channel and, um, keep up with, keep up with the Joneses, I guess. But anyway, like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification button. That way you guys know when we drop another video. Now, let's see if the maid is done. Sorry, my nose decided to just fill right up. Everything is starting to bloom here. You know, it does look like I might have added a little too much water, but you know what? It is what it is. So that's what it looks like. I don't know if you can see it really good, but it's nice and warm. It's really, really warm. So, okay. I'm going to move this out of the way. Let's go ahead and get this out of here. See, yeah, I may have added a little too much water, but you know what? It is absolutely fine. I'm not going to eat the water. But that looks really good, y'all. Even though it's got a little bit too much water. And that's on me. I should have measured a little bit better. But you know what? It is what it is. So, looks like we've got onions and, pe well, it's like peppers. Green peppers, red peppers. I don't see onions, but I see ham. Um, I don't really see cheese too much, but... What the heck? Let's get her done here. Let's see. It smells fantastic. Let's see if I can get like a green pepper and red pepper in there. Come on now. Peppers. There's a red pepper. There's a green pepper and some eggs and some ham. All right. Let's see what it tastes like. Oh my God. That's so good. That's really good. And the bacon or the, the ham is very smoky. It doesn't need any salt. That's good. Let's put a little hot sauce on it, though. Just to say we can. It's just for giggles, you know? Let's see. Can I get this one open? It's a challenge and a mystery. Well, it's not a mystery. It is a challenge, though. So. For the love of Pete, come off of there. Yeah, well... There we go. Come on. Come on out of there. Let me shake it up. Smells good. You know, I, sorry if that hurts y'all with... <laughs> any of y'all wearing headphones, my bad. Oh, boy. All right, let me mix that up. I think I am going to put some of that cheese in. Nah, you know what? I don't really want to. I'm going to leave it just like this. This is so good. Okay, now let's see. Get it out of that water. There you go, y'all. That's a bite with Tabasco. Mmm, mmm, mmm. That, that's a good meal. Very solid. Eggs are rehydrated very nicely. They're not spongy. Everything is real good. I, I could have used a little less, maybe an ounce less of water. Other than that, my goodness. Very good. I would definitely order this again. I would definitely just have them around for emergency purposes or whatever. Really good. 
Excellent. Excellent. Good choice I picked, I think. <laughs> I also got a breakfast skillet to try. And then in my case B, we got a maple sausage patty too. So we'll going to be trying all that. I just don't want to do all my breakfast stuff at once. Because, you know, breakfast is my favorite meal. I could do breakfast all day, any day. It doesn't matter what time of day. But anyway, I'm going to eat the rest of this off camera because that's my breakfast for this morning. Actually, it's 11 o'clock in the morning, so I'll be brunch. Mm. I had to get another drink of that. That's so good. But anyway, like I said, guys, it's the end of the video. Everything tastes delicious that I tasted. It is uh, uh, the menu number 10, scrambled eggs with cheese, western style. It also has ham in it. Um, I will be finishing this and the next video will probably be Wednesday and we'll just see what kind of surprise we have for Wednesday evening. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys have a great day. God bless you all. We love you. Like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification button and we'll see you guys on the next video. Bye. Love you guys.